Welcome everyone to change series voice the first step. Let's start by opening up the settings. And from here, you're going to scroll all the way down until you see accessibility. And then you're going to scroll all the way down again until you see personal voice. If you don't see the personal voice, you need iPhone 12 on newer and iPad with A14 on newer. So just upgrade. And then we're going to tap here, create a personal voice. And it's going to give you these on screen instructions. So we'll just tap on continue until we see the screen. When you're ready, tap on the microphone and speak what you say here. I'm creating a personal voice with my iPhone. And it will check if everything is okay. Great. And then we continue. So you tap on the microphone button and then it will go through one by one. So you say the phrase and it will move to the next phrase and you'll have to do this 150 times. If you speak, so let's say the river falls blah, 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 and you mess up, pause the speech and then tap on the repeat and then you can retry the phrase. If you don't want to do 150 phrases at once, tap on the done button and back in the personal voice area of settings, you can tap on your personal voice and then you can tap on continue recording and then you can continue at any time. Once this is done, your iPhone will need to be locked and it will need to be on a charger and you will need to leave your iPhone on the charger for one to two nights. If you do need to use your iPhone, the personal voice as it is generating only when your iPhone is locked and charging, the generation will pause so you don't have to just outright stop using your device. If you need to use it, great, but the personal voice will not continue running in the background only if the phone is locked and charging. Once the personal voice is created, you should see here, no generating sign, you should be good to go. And once you have done that, let's head to the home page of settings. And then we're going to go back into the accessibility. And then we're going to scroll down until we see live speech. Turn on the live speech here. And then under voices, tap on voices and then tap on your personal voice at the top and then tap on your personal voice one more time. So we're going to triple click the side button or we'll triple click the home button if we have a home button. And then you can type your phrase to speak. And once you've typed what you want to be spoken out, just tap on the send button. Hello, please leave a like on this video and subscribe if I helped you out getting personal voice to work. So it sounds a little bit robotic, but it kind of sounds like you at the, uh, the exact same time. If you want favorite phrases, tap on the uh, uh, phrases button and then tap into the favorite phrases and then create a new favorite phrase. And then when you triple click, you can tap the phrases button and just choose a favorite phrase, which you may be using commonly. At the time of recording, you can't switch the Siri voice to the personal voice. If this changes in the future, just go into the Siri voice settings and there should be at the top the personal voice option, but that is not available at the time of recording. With that being said, if you would like to help support the channel, please do check the description. Bye bye.